There's been a rumor that I've been offered two million dollars for, for Venom. It's tough to, uh, to put a value on a family member. He, he's definitely up there as some of the most uh, valuable or highest priced American bullies. Wow, uh, the first time we saw Venom, we saw him together, and we both, you know, we saw him on social media and Instagram and <laughs> things like that, and then seeing him in person for the first time to see, you know, a dog like him, it was, it was wow, it was very, it was very cool. Wouldn't you think? Yeah. So the first time I saw Venom, I was absolutely knocked off my feet. He was the most amazing, small dog. I couldn't believe they were even made that way. That Venom is the America's greatest uh, micro bully, for sure. Hands down, he is the best. Since the last time that uh, Barcroft came out. This is Venom, one of the world's most famous American micro bullies. Um, all of these are new dogs. So uh, we've got uh, Fury uh, over there. She's uh, ABKC pocket champion. Uh, that's a Venom daughter. I mean, if you hear me say Chunk, I'm referring to Venom. Uh, we, we don't call him Venom around the house. We call him Chunk. We've got a mini Chunk, is the one who's a little uh, chunk, a clone of Chunk. Uh, Savage, uh, that's his son right there. Uh, Snow, which is the little white one right there. Venom's got um, a little over 250 offspring. On average, Venom's puppies sell for around eight grand. Go for it. So many people have fallen in love with, uh, with Chunk. His personality, um, he's only 12 and a half inches tall, and uh, he's built, you know, he's built like a bodybuilder. American bullies are amazing dogs. Even pictures, they don't justify how awesome these dogs are. Uh, so the training that I do with the dogs, um, it's different with each one. So we try to cater it towards um, each individual dog. Uh, we play fetch. Uh, this guy's obsessed with the ball. A lot of people ask, you know, what type of uh, strength exercises do you do? Do you strap weights on your dog? We don't do any of that. The genetics in our line is gonna is gonna produce that muscle regardless. I mean, I've, I've owned and uh, raised other breeds of dogs. Their their diet isn't a whole lot different. Uh, the only thing is, we've got to make sure to uh, to exercise them because they really like to eat. I mean, if you don't give them proper exercise, then you'll notice the weight gain. Um, but we don't, we don't have an issue with that. He makes a lot of noises when he eats. Uh, Matt is extremely dedicated as far as vet appointments and traveling to wherever he has to travel to to take care of whatever he has to take care of for them. I did not know the type of breed or much about American bullies, but since having them, uh, I realized that they're probably one of the best breeds. He's special beyond uh, just looking really cool. Um, he's always happy. He gets along with every dog he's ever met. He's always in a good mood, whether it's time to eat, you know, if you bring out food, he's hopping around. There's been a rumor that I've been offered two million dollars for, for Venom. Uh, I've never been offered two million dollars. If I was offered $2 million for him, I mean, that's life-changing money, but I still wouldn't sell him. He's, he's a family member. And uh, what he's creating with his, with his own line um, and the joy that he brings our family, you, you can't put a price tag on that.